I just want to share a couple things that my father used to tell me when we were growing up. He said, it doesn't matter if you're a boy or you're a girl, it doesn't matter if you're rich or poor, it doesn't matter your color or your religion. If you work hard in school, you can do anything that you want. The other thing he said to us was, you know, if you, if you want to be a garbage collector, for example, be the best that you can be in whatever that you do. We don't, not everybody needs to be an engineer or a doctor. Follow your passion, follow your abilities, your talents, and whatever you do, be the best at what you do. This is Dr. Celine Gounder. She was recently appointed to the US President-elect Joe Biden's COVID-19 advisory board. After Tulasundarpuram village celebrated US Vice President-elect Kamala Harris's victory, another Tamil Nadu village, Permapalayam in Iro district is elated over the achievement of its daughter, Dr. Celine Gounder. Dr. Celine's father, Raj Natarajan Gounder, hailed from Permapalayam. He moved to US in the late 1960s and worked in the Boeing company. Unlike Kamala Harris, whose relatives all left Tulsandrapuram village decades ago, Selin had visited Permapalayam several times before establishing a foundation in her father's name in the year 2018. The Raj Gounder Foundation supports children's education and helps the government-run Mudagurchi Boys Higher Secondary School where her father studied. During her visit to the village, she always made time to interact with the students and motivate them to follow their passion. She sponsored the setting up of smart classrooms in the school. Every year, she provides scholarship to class 10 and class 12 toppers to pursue higher education. Apart from that, she has been actively supporting around 30 disabled children who are part of the Inclusive Education for Differently Abled Children Center or also known as IED Center in the village. During COVID lockdown, Celine realized that children would miss out on nutritious meals due to the schools being closed. So she had directed the school officials to deliver grocery kits at the doorsteps of children's houses to ensure they could access a healthy diet. Even before the lockdown was announced in India, she had made the villagers aware of COVID-19 and sent them guidelines on how to stay safe and prevent the spread of the disease in the village. Celine had an impressive career in health and infectious disease control. The 43-year-old doctor is a clinical assistant professor of medicine and infectious disease at the New York University's Grossman School of Medicine. She is also a practicing HIV infectious disease specialist, epidemiologist, a journalist and a filmmaker. She was elected a fellow of the Infectious Disease Society of America in their 2016 and in their 2017 People magazine named her one of the 25 women changing the world.